I'm comedian Terry Hart. My life is the joke, and this is Vlogmas. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Man, it doesn't show signs of stopping. And I'm Vlogmas. Okay, so yeah, what's popping? Vlogmas, day 15 and 16. That's what this is going to be. 15 and 16, because I made a clip yesterday just one clip and it was a probably like five minutes long and um i'm gonna insert it after this and you'll see how i was feeling yesterday and why you didn't actually get a video later yesterday evening after you got day 14 yesterday morning so i'm gonna post this today and then i should be all caught up which is what i thought i was gonna be yesterday but i just wasn't feeling it um hi guys <laughs> uh today is the two-year anniversary of my mom's passing it's december the 15th 2020 and i'm doing better today than i was the last couple days i hadn't said anything about this or anything but I had just been kind of lashing out and I had been angry and frustrated and thinking about all the other things that um, are like stressing me out and um, other areas that I'm like overwhelmed in. And so I kind of was trying to like not think about this. Um, but this was like the underlying issue. Um, I miss my mom. I miss my mom. And um there's not much i can do about that you know that just kind of is what it is um i'm thinking about like i said so much other stuff that is wrong or that i wish was different and it'd be nice to be able to just talk to her about it you know you know i don't know what would be different i don't know what would be different if certain things didn't happen, or if I didn't meet certain people, if I didn't come to Birmingham at all. Like, I don't know. But that's the only kind of stuff I can think about. Like, that's what's playing over and over in my mind. It's like, what more can I do? What more could I have done? What more am I going to do to change my circumstances? Um, That's just a lot, though. That coupled with today being the day that it is and missing my mom um it's just kind of running me excuse me kind of running me ragged you know i got a lot on my mind i have a lot on my mind and <laughs> i have a lot on my mind what i really would like to do is be able to go home and um lay in my bed and go to sleep but i can't even do that <laughs> it's not funny but you know you got laugh to keep from crying sometimes you got laugh to keep from crying sometimes and this is one of those instances where you just laugh it off like my bed is in the storage. <laughs> I be looking at that mattress in there and I be thinking like, boy, I can't wait to put you in a room that belong to me. In an apartment that don't nobody else live in but me. Or don't nobody pay the rent for me. And I can do that comfortably. And confidently. So look, y'all pray for me. Okay? Just pray for me. Um... Uh, Blogmas, I guess, been a little kind of weird maybe the last couple of days. But that's just because I got so much going on. But I am committed to consistency. I am determined and dedicated to putting out content and sharing how I feel. Because it's kind of like a video diary, you know? So that's just what's happening in my life right now. Like, this is how I feel. I'm not doing much. I'm just at work. And I don't have, like, an adventurous thing going on right now to show you when i do i will but right now i'm in my feelings i'm in my thoughts i'm in my head and i am 
going through some things and that's what is consuming my my life right now and so if i'm going to share my life then little videos like this is might be all you get this might be five minutes of me just talking like it was yesterday um well i think i put a video out this morning which was of me last night and it was like maybe like five minutes of me just talking wearing this sweatshirt and this jacket and not this shirt or these underwear i did take a shower and put on clean clothes um <laughs> but i was sitting in my car at the gas station last night and now i'm sitting in the parking lot on my lunch break at work and i'm just telling y'all that um today was a rough day it's not over yet so it could get better but emotionally it's a rough day i'm going to try to come back on later and show you more of my day but if i don't charge it to my head and my heart and thank you for watching everything that you have seen thus far on my channel i mean today's day 15 and even when i skipped days i still went back and, and put up like two videos so i should i should be all caught up um and that makes me happy and it makes me happy to know that you guys you guys are sticking with me and watching whatever i put out so thanks um so gas station gossip let's get into it let's just get into it maybe somebody had the nerve to call me selfish um and ultimately you just tell me if this makes sense to you or not when it came down to it, I wish I I wish I was just like super like horrible and kept I didn't keep the thread. This happened last night, but I didn't keep the thread. But if I had, I would have inserted the actual text messages. But um basically verbatim. If somebody is broke, stop inviting them to stuff that includes money. Okay. My hand is always ashy right there. Like always. Um, so, okay, I'm selfish because I invite my friend to stuff. Okay, we're all broke. We're all behind. We're all struggling. I invite you to stuff, for one, because I believe that you need a break, and I want you to still be enjoying your life, like, not be actually stressed out about what's going on in your life. I don't care how stressed out I am. It's some stuff is non-negotiable. I'm going a, I'm to a figure it out. I'm going to make it happen because that makes me feel good. That makes me happy. And what's crazy is that person is the same way. Like, you ain't out here with your nails not done or your hair never not did. But you starving. How? That means your priorities is, is, is not in order. They ain't got nothing to do with me. So, I, I'm just trying to make sure I'm not delusional. Um, Like I said, I told this person, like, okay, baby, here's my thing. This me with anybody. We don't got to be friends, but I'm not your enemy. We ain't beefing. Nope, not my thing. I'm not going back and forth with you on social media. For No, none of that. That's not cute. It's not ladylike. It's not my vibe, not my energy, not where I'm at. I got way too much other stuff going on, as you all know. So, if I'm, all, if I'm always the one reaching out to somebody to try to mend a friendship or figure out what the issue is. Girl, y'all had this person had the nerve to tell me. I said... So, the last time I talked to you, I asked you if there was something wrong, and you said no. She replies, I wanted you to figure it out. So, instead of when I directly asked your adult ass what the problem was, you said it wasn't no issue. And your reason for saying it was no issue is because you wanted me to figure it out. Girl, nope, not, I'm not 10, not 10, 26. I'm, I'm, I'm not six years old. I'm 26. Nope. So I just think people got to, people got to work on their self. People love to say they working on their self. And I think the, the understanding of what working on yourself really mean be going over their head. You're not working on yourself. You just doing enough to make it look make it look good for your like the people who 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 rooting for you the people who cheering for you no be real people don't be real and that be really really irking me i just whew, baby i be having to come on my youtube channel and vent now like that's really gas station gossip actually says she wants this to be a thing and it is gonna be a thing because i'm always at the gas station either i'm getting gas and filling up my tank because i can afford to do that or i'm coming to get a snack because i love to come get a little snacky snack so, I will be at the gas station giving y'all the tea, giving y'all the latest on what's 
stuff that be just driving me insane that I'm not finna just be putting on, like, I'm not about to be tweeting and stuff, like, I'm not finna be making, I'm not finna do all that. So, I will just come out here and talk to y'all. So, for one, there's video. If you ever want to hear what I say, you can always come back and watch it. Y'all remember when I was in college and I used to do, um, time out? When I used to have my time out thing where I just took a time out and I just vented to y'all. So, gas station gossip is essentially going to be that. This is where I just come vent and tell y'all, like how people get on my nerves <laughs> um but this this gas station gossip is also vlogmas so sorry there's not any i didn't film at work or nothing it, it work has been kind of weird too um we about to go on break so i'm gonna try to keep the uploads coming i just can't tell you what they're gonna look like because i actually really don't know um but again like i said in the um clip from yesterday thank y'all if you watched so far and you've been keeping up thank you just thank you every day thank you because one or two views 50 views five thousand views five million views they all matter to me the same somebody's watching whoever's commenting thank you to reed and kaya and ashley y'all always commenting and close so that means a lot to me y'all being a part of the conversation because y'all my little friends or whatever um no shade <laughs> but i really appreciate it i really honestly truly do so that was that was my little rant for today people saying i'm i'm, I'm somebody saying that i'm selfish and stuff and not genuine just blew me like that blew me at my big age at my younger age you're right today that ain't me and you're not gonna put that put that on me i'm i bet i cast that spell back the hell where it came from so <laughs> That's all I got for y'all today. Uh, let me know if y'all like gas station gossip because I will, I will push that and I will find a place for that here on the channel. Like I said, it might be inserted into vlogs, but if you want that to be a separate thing, let me know. Hey, we can get this content calendar booming for 2021. Um, uh, other than that, uh, I love you and <laughs> till next time.